Bronx raised Cardi B offers to pay fire victim burial costs. Could that be a means of a character to live for her in lieu of her trial with Tasha K? What up, what up? Hey, lovelies. We are now on Apple Podcasts. Yes, yes, yes. For my iPhone users, you know, just a little something for you. Head over to the Apple Podcast app and type in Whitney DTV in the search bar and click the check to add me to your dashboard and listen to your girl on the go. Powered by Anchor FM by way of Spotify. What up, what up, everybody? Welcome to the channel. If you're new, don't be. Go ahead and click that subscribe button to be a part of the Witness Gang to join the Witness Nation. Now let's get into this, shall we? Hello, you guys, and welcome to the channel. If you're new, don't be. Okay. I'm Whitney. Keep it cute. Get the boo. Your girl, as whack as she is in all her glory, was in the New York Times. All right, you guys, welcome. Okay, so you guys know that I have been your one-stop shop when it comes to the trial and crazy banter that is pursuing with R. Kelly, but... In lieu of, of chains of events, baby, your girl has been a super sleuth when it comes to this whole Cardi B and Tasha K trial, okay? And this is no different, okay? So this kind of was raising um, eyebrows to a few people in my chat as well as um, I saw in comments and things to that nature, okay? So you know we're about evidence over emotions over here. What a witness nation. Now you know we're super sleuths over here. We all about the facts, evidence over emotions. Let's see what we've discovered. So not for nothing, I stumbled across this article on Twitter, um, apnews.com, and it says Bronx raised Cardi B offers to pay victim, uh, um, pay fire victim burial costs. Um, and it goes on to say, New York AP Cardi B has offered to pay the burial costs uh, um, for all 17 people killed in a fire that ripped through a New York City high rise. New York City Mayor Eric Adams announced, uh, announced Wednesday that the Grammy winning rapper had offered the financial relief for victims of the fire in the Bronx where she grew up. Many of the victims had, try, had uh, ties to Gambia and families of several of victims plan to bury them in their West African homeland. Cardi B has committed to paying the uh, repatriation expensive um, for the victims who will be buried in Gambia, uh, the mayor's office said. I'm extremely proud to be from the Bronx and I have lots of family and friends who live and work there still. So when I heard about the fire and all of the victims, I knew I needed to do something to help. Cardi B in a statement. I cannot begin to imagine the pain and anguish that the families of the victims are experiencing, but I hope that not having to worry about the costs associated with burying their loved ones will help as they move forward and heal. I send my prayers and condolences to everyone affected by this horrific tragedy. The fire, which was New York City's deadliest in three decades, was sparked by a faulty space heater, according to authorities. The headline on this story has been corrected to show that Cardi B was raised, not born in the Bronx. Now, I wanted to um, speak on this because um, I feel like it's completely acid on, okay, for people to use this very, very heroic, very beautiful story and situation when it comes to Cardi B even offering to pay as a ploy to look good in a trial that she has going on. Not for, not for nothing to... Um, 
to to use the hypocrisy, if you will, because not for nothing, just uh, I want to say last week, Tasha K posted how she was helping a, a a wife of 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 some man or whatever, you know what I'm saying? And let's be real, um, just like Cardi B, this is not the first time that Tasha K has actually did these acts of services. She does it. Uh, around the same time every year when it comes to December uh, around Christmas time she always does like her her tour drives and donations and things to that nature um it's been no different however one can suspect if we're going to do this when it comes to Cardi B that hmm could this be about her character because now all of a sudden um Tasha K is posting things this stuff happened last month why all of a sudden is she still posting and why now and mm, you know and so in regards to Cardi B, I do not think this is a ploy to look good um, in the court trial to see, oh, you know, uh, one can say that because as we've been covering the evidence here at Whitney D TV, okay, exclusively, you won't find that anywhere else. The transcripts that we dropped on last night, okay, all right. But not for nothing, we see in there that um, Cardi B's hands aren't necessarily clean when it comes to this trial. However, do I think that these are um, have some kind of correlation? I would have to disagree. I would say that this is not the first time Cardi B has um, done such acts of service as this, and I don't think it's anything different. I think I just really, honest to God, think it's um, a situation when it comes to coincidence. OK, now I know most people say, um, you know, I don't believe in coincidences. I do when it comes to the situation in this. I, I, I just feel like that's so disgusting for people to sit up here and say, mm, you know, maybe she's doing this because she's in trial. and She wants to look a certain way. I get it. You know, what I'm saying um, you have all this money. You have an opportunity to utilize it in the best way that you possibly can. And you're helping people in your community. Why not? You know, what I'm saying so I just applaud Cardi B. In regards to her um, extending uh, a hand like that. No shade, no tea. We ain't heard nothing from the likes of any other celebrities that have grew up in in, in um, uh, Bronx do anything. Well, actually, let me take that back. I actually remember, I think it was um, Peter Guns and a few other men that actually um, have stepped up in, in regards to this situation when it comes to New York and this fire. And my heart goes out. I saw, I didn't dig too deep, because y'all know I ain't good with death and all this stuff. I just, it, it, it really, really connects with my spirit and it makes me like get in a state of depression. I don't even have to know these people, but I, I can feel the grief. And so I just, I'm very disconnected when it comes to the likes of trying to uh, speak on things to this nature. However, when I saw this, and like I said, we were covering the evidence on last night when it came to um, the Cardi B and Tasha K trial. And I saw in my comments, some people stating, well, you know, she did, you know, give that money. And you had other people asking, hmm, you know, and no shade, you know, inquire minds would like to know why, you know, and that is very interesting. But my opinion I don't think that uh, this has nothing to anything to do uh, with her trial and what she has going on with Tosh K. If anything, I think it's the total opposite. This gives her an opportunity to disconnect, to do something that she's been doing, to be able to uh, extend an olive branch, to extend, um, extend a hand for those that need help. Okay, not for nothing, you guys. That is it. That is the video. Tell me what you think down in the comments below. While you're there, make sure you like and share this video, sharing is caring, okay? And, and, and that actually gets me exposed to people that possibly wouldn't know about Whitney D TV. So share, share, share. You can do it here on YouTube or you can choose the platform in which you would like to share, okay? If you got informed, inform another person by sharing, okay? And make sure you click that subscribe button if you have not done so already. We are on our way to 6K. <sighs> and the crown goes wide. I think we're, last I checked, was like a hundred and um, something away from it. So we're almost there, okay? And not for nothing. Um, make sure you guys click that notification. Move it from personalized to all so you can receive all of my, uh, the notifications for any uploads or anytime that I go live, okay? Well, that's it for me. Leave your comment and keep it cute so you won't get a boot, okay? I'm Whitney D and I am signing off. Deuces.
keep it cute, and give it a boo.